What's up y'all, welcome back to another episode. Today we're talking all about the Neversink Farm Tilther. We just got this tool recently, so I'm gonna give you my honest review of this tool. We really love it so far, but let's jump into it. Okay, so jumping right in, this is a really awesome tool. Um, the Tilther, obviously Johnny Seed creates another Tilther, um, but in my opinion, I think this has some more features and a little bit, and is a little bit more superior in the way they designed it. So this tool's perfect for mixing in amendments. Uh, maybe you need to flip a bed and there's some old plant debris you need to work into the soil. We're actually gonna show you right now, um, we're gonna use this on a bed that has some old carrots in it. It's got some weeds growing. Cause I just wanna show you the capabilities of this tool. Obviously if I just showed me mixing in amendments, then it's not gonna really give you a clear picture of what this tool is capable of. It is run by a drill. I would recommend getting the a, a large battery for these because if you're just using a tiny battery on your drill they will die pretty quickly so spend you know 50 100 bucks to get a really fat battery so that you can do multiple beds with this thing one thing i do like about this is it's adjustable and the johnny's tilter is adjustable as well but that way you can walk on either side of the bed with you know as you're running it down you can get in your walkways that way you're not walking on um, your beds so i think that's a really cool tool it's also got this strap right here, which is great, you know, as you're walking, you know, let's say you just wanna throw it on your shoulder and you know, you need to walk it across the farm. That really helps, cause it is, I mean, it's decently heavy, but not bad. So the strap's a really cool feature. The other thing I like about these is it's got these grip handles on it, almost like a bicycle. Um, same with the lever, it's almost like a bike brake. Okay, so I know you wanna see it in action, so let me stop talking about it and let's see this thing in action. Okay, so as you can see, there's still some weeds that are in here. I've only done one pass, um, but it's also breaking up some of the old carrots, so it's gonna terminate those, and it's also gonna terminate the weeds. Now, this bed is gonna take a few passes with this, which I'm gonna show you here in a second, but the great part is, is having to weed this by hand or with a tool is very labor intensive. So being able to run this over the top of the beds and do several passes, and then you've got a bed ready to plant in, to me is just really valuable. It's gonna add a lot of efficiency to the farm or to your garden. So, you know, I will say if you've got some really deep rooted weeds that are really established, I don't know if this tool is going to be able to take care of that. But with that being said, let's just continue to test it out and see if we can terminate, you know, some of these weeds that are currently growing in this bed. Okay, so that was three passes with the tilter. As you can see, I mean, this is really good mixed up. We've broken up a lot of the weeds. Now, obviously some of these weeds could grow, grow back where we didn't get the roots very well. However, for the most part, to me, that looks really good. So from here, obviously you could add your amendments, you could add compost, and then you could run over this bed again with the tilter to really mix that in. The great part about the tilter is we're not going down really far. With the tilter, you're only going down about one to two inches on the soil surface. So it's not like a traditional tiller where we're really breaking up that soil. So this is gonna work really great. And I'm excited about this tool. If you found this content helpful and you wanna see more of it, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And we look forward to seeing y'all on the next video. Happy growing.